These days, it is almost impossible for you to make any transaction online without using a virtual card in Nigeria. So in this video, I want to show you how to use Gray, the Gray virtual card app, so that you can use, use it to make payments online using your virtual card. So I'll show you how Gray works, how to create a virtual card with Gray, how to fund this card with Gray, and how to equally do the calculation for the rate you are going to pay with Gray. So before we begin, please like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel if this video helps you. So the first thing you need to do is go to the Gray app and then register. I'm going to put a link to Gray in the description of this video. So Gray is a fintech app and what they do is that they provide you with um, international bank accounts and equally provide you with virtual cards that you can use for your online payments. Again, we know that in Nigeria currently it's very difficult to make payments using our online, our regular Nigerian debit card. So Great tries to make that easy for you, but at a cost. All right. So the first thing is to register. Great, and if you come to Great, this is the interface you are going to see after your registration. You might need to do some kind of KYC to verify that you are a real human being. So if you come right here, you can, if you click at the top, you find different accounts that you have. So Gray gives you a great British pounds account, an Euro account, a dollar account, and then the Nigerian Naira account. I think you can add more and you can select the Tanzanian shilling, the Kenyan shilling, and um, the Ugandan shilling. Currently, we do not have any need for that now. So if you want to see your account details, inside of gray you can come here and click on these and you are going to see all your pending balance currently i do not have any money right here but if you scroll down you are going to see your great british pound account and all the information right here i'm going to block some of these things because youtube doesn't want us to put this kind of information online so if you scroll down you can see all the details and if you come down here it's going to tell you the kind of payment that you can receive with this account so it's basically the same thing you can add money to this account and you can equally send money to other people using great tag you can send it to um, set a beneficiary and send it to them and all of that good stuff so you can equally swap fund inside of gray which is like very common knowledge because for you to actually send um british pound or us dollars to other people you need to first convert your naira to that us dollars they are going to do this conversion using their own rate, which is like um, whatever they want. All right. So you don't expect to get the official bank rate from them. So they have their own rate because this is a third party app. So they operate using black market rates. So since we are now done with that, currently Gray doesn't issue US account. I used to have one, but they terminated it. They've not given me another one since then. So if you wanted to just request a bank account, you can come here, click on request. And then you can see here, yes, it says create a foreign account. And you click on that and it brings out your name and you can just say get USD. USD account is going to ask you for something, some kind of simple verification and the account will be created. So we are hoping that this comes back. But until then, we are stuck with them. Um, the euros, the great British pound, and then the Nigerian Naira. So now, how do you create cards, virtual cards inside of Gray? So what you need to do is after you have registered, you want to come to this place that says cards. So I'm basically doing this using a smartphone, but Gray equally has a website and you can do it on the website if you prefer website. So if I click on cards, you can see that we have two types of cards. Gray offers you two types of cards. So we have the virtual card and the physical debit card that they say is coming soon. So I currently do not even have any of these cards. So this is a fine opportunity for me to show you how it works. So you click on get started and this is the card. So it gives you the benefit of the card that you can instantly create a prepaid virtual card to make online payments across um, multiple websites. So I've heard that this card works basically everywhere. I personally have not tried it because I have a lot of um, cards that I use already. So these cards, creating them cost money. So I cannot create for all the platforms that I make videos about. So you just want to click on create a virtual card and then it gives you what you need to know. So you are going to be charged a one-time fee of $4. So Grace is charging you for this card. This $4 is the 
card issuance fee or card creation fee and then you are going to be deducted an additional one dollar will be deducted from your balance to fund your card so you need to have at least five dollars so you can fund with a minimum of one dollar which will be added to your card then they are going to take four dollars which is the card creation fee so you need to take note of that so if you want to create this card you just click on create card now it says insufficient fund because i do not have any money for them to debit so if you had dollar they are just going to debit it and then they are going to create the card for you now I'll go back and then i'll show you how to add the money so that they can credit it and create the card for you so if i come back here and then i want to switch to my naira account so i have my naira account right here and i want to you want to first of all once you click on the naira account you see you can find your account details right here all right and you can click on add money as you can see i currently do not have any balance here so you can equally use this um, um nigerian account this naira account to do any kind of transaction you want you can use it to receive money and send money but first we need to add money swap this money to the us dollars before we can create that card so if you click on add money you want to um they currently have just one way of the um putting money or depositing money which i do not really like so you can click on that and then you click on let's say we want to add fifty thousand nigerian naira so another thing i do not like about gray is that they charge you for depositing money which other cards don't so other people don't i don't know why they do this maybe it's because of the um debit method they have for other cards i've created videos on you can just transfer to this and it's basically the official transfer fee which is sometimes 10 naira 15 naira and thereabout but now they want us to pay 85 naira so if you pay that 85 naira you can say you want to make a transfer and then it's going to create a payment details for you that you can send to i personally do not want to proceed with this transaction but as you can see it gives you all the information that you need so if you click on continue you are going to be able to just select any of the banks right here and send the money so let's say i wanted to use gt and you click on gt you can now log into your gt and carry out this um, payment if you wanted to but the moment you deposit your money you want to come back here your money is going to show right here the amount you've deposited in this case fifty thousand, is going to show right here and then you want to come to swap you want to swap this money and you want to swap it to the us dollars so this is how you actually know the rates that gray is going to charge you they do not make it very clear i don't know why but maybe because these things fluctuate but this is what you should know say we wanted to swap our 50 our 50,000 to the us dollars and then you click you click on 50,000 and you see they equally still charge you 500 naira for swapping this so you have to pay attention to these charges so this 50,000 is going to get you 63 dollars 63 dollars 85 cents so for you to know the rate i want to open my calculator it, this is actually the rate right here but it's still confusing most people are not going to understand this so you want to go to your calculator and check um, 50,000 divided by 63.8 so let me go to my calculator so i say 50,000 divided by 63.8 you see that grade charges us 783 which is slightly high but if this is fine for you no problems you can just proceed and say swap so after swapping you will have these dollars in your dollar account and from there you can now go back to the card creation so if you come back to this card creation and say create a virtual card it's going to debit your card your usa account and then this card will be created and then you have a card that you can use online so this is basically how to use gray how to create a virtual card and for you to make payment with these virtual cards all you have to do is go to any website that you want to purchase from you have to put the account the card details that they've provided in the card so after creating the card they are going to provide a card detail that you can use to um, put on the website and then this payment will be successful so this is how to basically use gray and how to get virtual cards using gray i hope this video helped you please like this video subscribe to this youtube channel my name is Good Noel. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.